Welcome to IBM Support TV, where we answer questions and share technical support information, hints and tips on IBM products. Welcome to this short presentation on Netcall Omnibus event definition. The identifier is a unique primary key field in the object service alert.status table. It is typically made up of generic clear fields, although it could be made up of any string that uniquely defines the event, such as the alarm number from another system. The serial number is defined automatically by the object server. It is an auto incrementing integer whose value increases to the maximum allowed for 32 bit integers. If the object server processes one event per second, it would take 68 years for an object server serial to roll back to one. Server name and server serial are set in the object server's new underscore row trigger to the current object server's name and serial value, provided they are not set already. Their values define the event in a multi-tier system, the same way the identifier does in the object server. Therefore, their values need to be consistent. In this example, the probe's rules file defines the problems event identifier as an event plus one. The identifier defines the event in the object server. When the event arrives at the object server for the first time, it is automatically assigned a serial value, one, two, three, four, five. The col underscore new underscore row trigger assigns the server name and server serial with the server serial being the same as the assigned serial 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 and the server name being the name of the object server in this case col underscore p underscore 1 The collection to aggregation gateway forwards the event to the aggregation layer as a new insert If the event does not already exist it is assigned a serial value for the object server ag p In this example serial is set to 55441122. The ag underscore new underscore row trigger preserves the server name and server serial so that together they uniquely define the event for the gateways. The aggregation to display gateway forwards the event to the display layer. If the event does not already exist, it is assigned a serial value for the object server. Dis underscore one. In this example, serial is set to 132497. The DSD underscore new underscore row trigger preserves the server name and server serial so that together they uniquely define the event for the gateways. In this manner, the event's definition is preserved throughout the system. When the resolution event is sent from the probe, in this case an event plus two, it is inserted as a new unique event and assigned a new serial one, two, three, four, six. The col underscore new underscore row trigger assigns the server name and server serial as before, with the server serial being this event serial value. The collection to aggregation gateway forwards the event to the aggregation layer as a new insert. The event is assigned a serial 54322. The ag underscore new underscore row trigger preserves the server name and server serial, so that together they uniquely define the event for the gateways. For these two events, provided the generic clear fields are set correctly, they will automatically be cleared by the generic clear trigger. Depending upon the timings, the display and backup aggregation object servers will reflect the problem, resolution and their clearing. With the generic clear, the resolution is removed and the problem is set to severity 0, ready for deletion. From this example, we saw that the events were defined by their identifier and within the multi-tier system by the server name and server serial. Provided the event persisted in the collection layer, the server serial would remain the same for each reinsert. The collection expire time defines when events are deleted in the collection layer. By default, the col underscore new underscore row trigger sets collection expire time to 30 seconds if it is not set already. The identifier defines the event in the object server. Server name and server serial defines the event in the multi-tier system. This is because the gateways use server name and server serial to identify events in the object server. Thanks for watching this episode of IBM Support TV. Please leave a comment with topics you would like to see in future episodes. Until then, stay tuned.